In this video tutorial, we're going to be showing you how to change your Archon password on your Sublight server's Rust server. It's actually very simple, but at first it might not seem like it. The easiest way to do it, make sure your server is stopped. I've already went ahead and done that. Sometimes it'll take between five and 30 seconds to stop your server. Once your server is stopped, go ahead and go to the command line manager. Go ahead and select this. It'll already say selected, just hit it again. It'll bring down a dropdown. Here is your Archon password. As you can see, I just have it set to CoolPass123. I'm just gonna go ahead and add 456. Don't change your server identity. If you haven't um, done anything with any special maps or anything like that, you never wanna touch the server identity or you'll break your server. Just go ahead and hit apply. As you can see, it'll say the command line has been changed to default. Now we're gonna go ahead and go back to the server and we're gonna get, go ahead and hit start. We're just gonna go ahead and wait till this starts up. While we do that, just to make this a little easier, we're just gonna go ahead and copy the password because we're gonna verify once your server is started that it's actually working. We're gonna go ahead and open up just the face punch uh, web archon so that once this gets going, we'll have it all ready. So while this starts up, let's go ahead and paste the password. And then it's gonna be the Ar uh, Archon address and port. That is right here. As you can see, Archon information. Just copy that, copy and paste. Now we're gonna wait until this shows the server count or the player count. And you wanna make sure your auto refresh is on. Sometimes it'll take up to a few minutes for your server to start. It just depends on the um, performance tier that you've selected when you ordered your server and how much you have going on on your server. Servers with a lot of entities, a lot of structures, things like that will take a lot longer to start. So just be aware of that. We're just waiting till this starts up. And as you can see, it is now zero out of 50. We're gonna wait about 10 seconds because uh, sometimes it's still, you know, doing some background stuff. The Archon's still initializing, you know, things like that. Now that that's good, we're just gonna go ahead and hit connect. And then as you can see, I've connected with that new password that I set. Um, once you're in here, you can see the basic details about your art, about your server. You can see your server console, your chat, and your player list of who's connected to it. It's very, very simple. Um, and if for some reason that doesn't work, um, changing the password doesn't work, you can't connect, just go ahead and open the support ticket and we'll take a peek at it. Anyway, thank you for watching this Sublight Servers video tutorial.